want to stay on top of that breaking news out of East Lansing. In just the last 30 minutes, we learned MSU's interim president will quit in one week. 24 Hour News 8's Leon Hendricks is live on campus with some new information from Engler's resignation letter. Leon, what do you have? Marley, good evening to you. Word is that he has penned an 11 page letter dictating exactly why he's resigning and saying that it is because he was asked to do so by the Board of Trustees here at Michigan State University. We're talking about the resignation of John Engler. He has been appointed the interim president to serve after the former president resigned under pressure, but there have been a lot of issues surrounding his presidency, namely comments made to the media that have drawn the ire and frustration of victims who've called him tone deaf and insensitive in the wake of the Nasser situation. Now, uh, the letter is supposedly uh, going to the Board of Trustees. They're supposed to meet tomorrow, during which time they were expected to fire him if he didn't resign first. But he submitted that letter, and the Associated Press apparently has a copy of it, and they have uh, released some portions of it. I want to show you one of those portions. It says, quoting here, in compliance with your request that I resign, and in order to ensure an orderly transition to my interim successor, I hereby resign the office of President of Michigan State University effective 9 a.m. Wednesday, January 23rd. He goes on to say, it has been an honor to serve my beloved university. So this is just uh, another step in this process. We've been talking to some students here on campus who say that they're hopeful that this uh, removal will uh, uh, help in the healing process here. Uh, the very same thing that the Board of Trustees was hoping that Engler would be able to to lead the process of. We'll be out here in the morning during the Board of Trustees meeting tomorrow. We expect that to still take place, so stay tuned for coverage. We're live on the campus in East Lansing, Leon Hendricks, 24-hour News 8.